Now, uh, one of the top uh, trending stories in the US right now is the unveiling of the Tesla Model 3, which is being billed as the car that might change the world, no less. It's uh, $35,000. It's a sedan designed to take electric cars uh, and make them mainstream. Uh, Tesla founder uh, Elon Musk said it's probably the most profound car that we make uh, and promises a range of at least 200 uh, miles. That's 320 kilometers per charge. Let's speak to Tom Parsons, deputy editor of technology website Stuff. TV. Hello there, Tom. Uh, what do you make of it? Oh, I think it's um, I think it's very exciting. Um, Tesla has been uh, has been busy building a, a sort of reputation as a, a tech company first, and and then a, a car company second. And it started with with kind of uh, very uh, sort of high performance, high value products um, that were designed for a very premium market. But the goal has always been to go towards a, a sort of more affordable uh, family uh, family car. And so this is really the culmination of, of a number of years of, of research and development that Tesla have been undertaking. So will it manage it? Will it manage to turn things mainstream? Will normal folk be able to, to buy these cars? I, I think probably yes. I mean, there is there are still uh, there are still issues to overcome um, in terms of you know I'm, I'm in London and uh, certainly if you're if you're in a, a very built up city and ha and live in an apartment uh, rather than a house with a drive, how you charge your car on a daily basis is is still a, a tricky prospect. Um, but the public uh, charging network is becoming uh, is becoming far far better spread, um, far more usable, and and Tesla is leading that with its own uh, network of superchargers. I think there's no denying at this point Tesla's commitment um, and I think uh, the Model 3 will bring it to, to, to greater masses basically. Yeah and, and there are some very keen people aren't there to order yeah, sure these are, cars. Yeah. Tell me about them very briefly. Uh, yeah I mean uh, this chap Andrea Stevens uh, basically pre-orders um, have opened across the world this morning as uh, Tesla stores have opened um, and that means that, that in Australia they were open first. They were the first to be able to pre-order. Uh, so this chap, Andrea Stevens, uh, spent 48 hours camping outside uh, his his local Tesla branch in Australia, so he could be the first to pre-order. Unfortunately for him, um, because the way uh, Tesla's rolling out this new model uh, in the States first, West Coast to East Coast, and then Europe, and then Australia, despite being the very first person in the world to pre-order it, he's by no means going to be the first person to actually get his hands on his car. OK, all right, we'll see. Thanks very much. That's a Tom Parsons from uh, website uh, stuff.tv. You're listening to Outside Source.